Heavenly Father, I pray and I thank you so much. I want to give a day and time of thanksgiving, Father. I thank you for your goodness and your kindness and your faithfulness to me. I love your wonderful attributes and characteristics of you being so faithful, so sincere and genuine and authentic and being the God of truth and being truth and being long-suffering, faithful, kind, loving to me, that you never give up on me no matter what the devil and his demons say about me, no matter what evil people say about me. You never give up on me. You never stop loving me. You never stop protecting me. You never stop providing for me. You never stop looking out for me. You never stop being loyal to me. I thank you for your loyalty and your faithfulness and your kindness, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I give you glory and honor to you, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father. I thank you, Father God, for your goodness. I thank you for your diligence, your consistency, your holiness, your righteousness, your integrity, that you are the God of integrity and righteousness. You are a God of holiness. You are a holy God. You are a righteous God. You are a God of integrity. You are a God of reverence, Father. I thank you for honoring me all the time and giving me your divine respect and consideration. I thank you for your compassion, Father God, I thank you so much, Father, for your empathy. Father God, I thank you for your encouragement, the encouragement of your word, the promises of your word, that you are faithful to keep the promises of your word all the time, Father, that you never go back on your word and your promises of your word. And you always do what you say you're going to do. You always keep your promises. You never lie to me. You never play games with me. You never manipulate me or control me or violate my free will. I thank you that you're a God that allows anyone to have their free will and that you don't usurp over anyone's free will or violate anybody's free will, Father God. And you do not operate in the spirit of witchcraft toward any of your children and towards me. I thank you that you're not a control freak, Father God. You're not a controller, Father God. You're not a handler, Father God. You're not a dominator, Father God. You're not a totalitarian. You're not tyrannical, Father God. I'm so glad that you're not a tyrannical ruler, Father God. Even though you're the ruler above all rulers, Father God. I thank you, Father God, that you never dominate me nor control me or violate my free will, Father God. You never enforce me to do something against my own will, Father God. And I really appreciate that in you. Father, and I thank you for that. I thank you, Father, for being faithful to me and loyal to me no matter what, Father. No matter what, despite of all the troubles that I go through every day, the afflictions I go through, the persecutions I go through, Father God, every day, including today, Heavenly Father, that you're always there for me. You never leave me nor forsake me, Father God, and you're that way towards all your children everywhere in the world, Father God. And you are the father to the fatherless and to the orphans, Father God, and to the widows. You are the defender of the widows. And I thank you, Father God, that you are good all the time, no matter what. You're good, you're merciful, you're kind, you're gracious. I thank you for your favor, Father God your divine favor that I'm surrounded by your favor Father God I thank you for your son Jesus the gift of Jesus and the blood of Jesus I thank you Father God for pardoning me for my sins and forgiving me of my sins and cleansing me from all my iniquities through the blood of Jesus and perfecting those things that concern me and that you are faithful to complete the work that you have begun in me through your son Jesus Father God you're not done with me yet you are perfecting those things that concern me you are molding and shaping me because you are the potter and I'm the clay Father God 
you are molding me and shaping me in your image to be more like you, to be more like your son, Jesus, Father God, to be a righteous, integrous, sanctified person, a better character, a person, Father, through your son, Jesus, and by the power of the Holy Spirit, the help of the Holy Spirit and your help. I thank you, Father God, I am what I am today because of you, Father, that you are the Father that gives me identity through your Son, Jesus, and your word, Father, who I am through your Son, Jesus, Father God, according to the standards of your word, Father God. I thank you and I praise you, Father God, that you are God of holiness and righteousness, and there's nothing but righteousness and holiness in you. There's no evil in you, Father. You can never do any type of evil. You're the God that does good all the time and righteousness and holiness and integrity all the time. You're a God that never changes, Father. You're the same today, yesterday, and forever, for all eternity, Father God. I thank you that you're a God that's not flaky and shaky. Father God, you are consistent in all and diligent in all your ways and your works and all the your characteristics you're not sour with me one day and and sweet with me another day you're consistent in being sweet and kind to me all the time and loving to me all the time forever father god for all eternity Father God, you're not shaky and flaky like some people that I come across to, Father God, and you're not even flaky like I can be at times, but you're very consistent all the time and diligent all the time in all your ways and all your works and miracles. I thank you for the great miracles that you do in my life, Father, and have done in my life and done in the lives of all your children everywhere in the world, Father God. I thank you so much that you are the God, my deliverer, Father God, and my defense, Father God, against my adversaries. And you are my vindication. You are my vindicator. And you are giving me vindication against my enemies. And you fight against the ones who fight against me. You contend with the ones who contend against me. I thank you, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father, for the army of your angels to protect me all the time and to defend for me against my adversaries, against the devil and the demons and the evil human agents of the devil that come against me every day. Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, you are my deliverer to deliver me from my oppressors and from the witches and the warlocks and from the witchcraft and generational curses that I am redeemed from the curse of the law because because of the blood of Jesus, because of what Jesus Christ, your son, has done on Calvary, Father God, over 2,000 years ago. Heavenly Father, through the blood, I thank you for the blood of Jesus that cleanses and delivers and saves and redeems, Father God, and makes me whole and clean in my heart from iniquities. I thank you so much, Father, for forgiving me many times, Father God, and putting up with me through thick and thin, no matter how flaky I can be at times, Father, with you. Father God, in Jesus' name, I thank you for forgiving me when I get angry and have a temper tantrum with you, Father God, that you are quick to forgive me and to deliver me from having temper tantrums with you and getting impatient with you. But I thank you, despite of me being impatient with you at times, I thank you that you're always patient with me and long-suffering with me and all your children, Father God, and you're God that knows who was best your father who knows what's best for all your children and you know what's best for me father god you're the father who knows what's best for me all the time you're god of wisdom and knowledge and understanding and discernment and foresight and insight father god you're the god that knows everything father god and is everywhere father god you're the god that can do many multitasks of every good thing everywhere in the world upon every soul in the world father and upon your children everywhere in the world you're omnipresent everywhere father god you know everything about me good bad and ugly you still love me anyway unconditionally forever 
I thank you for your unconditional love in me, Father God, that it never wavers. You never flake out in loving me. You never flake out with your compassion and your love and kindness and grace and mercies. Your tender mercies every day are new for me and for your children everywhere in the world. I thank you, Father God, for defending me against my adversaries and being my restoration, restoring everything that the devil ever takes from me. I thank you for delivering me out of the hand of the devil into your hand, Father God. I thank you for delivering me from all evil, danger, and harm, and evil spirited people, and evil situations, and curses, and hexes, and witchcraft, and witches, and warlocks. I thank you for bringing breakthrough in my life, Father God, to bring freedom and emancipation in my life, and liberty and autonomy in my life, Father God, for delivering me from Pharaoh and the Egyptians, and from the control freaks, and from the witches and the warlocks, from total terrorism, Father, and communism, Father God. Thank you for delivering me, Father God, from evil totalitarians, Father God, and tyrannical spirited people, and tyrannical spirits, Father God, and from the tyrannical devil, Father God, in Jesus' name, by your mighty power. I thank you, Father God, for your mighty power, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, that has the power to save and deliver me from every evil demonic foe, from the devil, and from every evil situation, Father, that you will to deliver me from. I thank you for your word, Father God, that uplifts and encourages and corrects and rebukes you of God that chastises your children when it's necessary in a very kind and loving way, but is not abusive and harmful. Father God, to the souls of your children and to my soul as your child and the many times that you had to chastise me in my life father god to correct me and to rebuke me in your word and through leaders christian leaders so father god i thank you so much for just sticking by me and helping me to stick by you, to love you unconditionally, just like you love me unconditionally. But my love is not greater than your love, Father God. Your thoughts are higher and your ways are higher than my ways. And you don't think like me, Father God. You don't think like any humans on this earth, but you think way above and beyond any humans, Father God, that we think. You see a lot greater and more intently than we see. Your eyes do. Your eyes see everything that we do and say. And you take good, accurate records, Father, in your heavenly court. So, Father, I just want to take the time to say thank you for everything you have ever done for me all my life. Including today, Father God. Despite of all the witchcraft that I'm dealing with, the witches and the enemies that gang up against me everywhere in the city that I live in, in the state that I live in, and in the nation that I live in, Father God, you are still there for me. You are never going to turn against me, no matter what the devil says about me, no matter what the witches say about me, what the stalkers say about me, what my enemies say about me. You always speak life over me of your word over me through your son Jesus and the blood of Jesus always fights for me and speaks for me and delivers me and your love always defends me and molds me and holds me and embraces me Father God and your kindness and mercies always give me hugs throughout the entire day I thank you so much for everything Father God you are a great and mighty wonderful God and I thank you for being a great and mighty wonderful God all the time forever to me as your child and to all your children everywhere in the world Father God in Jesus Christ's name and even to all mankind everywhere in the world Father in the mighty name of Jesus Christ you are a good and mighty wonderful righteous holy long suffering God faithful and patient and kind and forgiving Thank you for helping me to forgive others just like you forgive me, Father, and cleansing me from my sins and iniquities through the blood of Jesus and delivering me from all types of evil. In the name of Jesus, amen.
Hallelujah.